All right, everyone, here we see a patch of stinging nettles. You can see, well, maybe you can actually see, little tiny spines on the stems. Contrary to myth, the leafy part here, you can touch that and it doesn't do anything. It's these little tiny spines on the stem, and you're not supposed to do things like this. No, that would burn. <laughs> well, at least if you're a normal person. I'm actually apparently resistant to this, to the point where I can, you know, do whatever I want. Thought about the possibility of, you know, sticking my cock in them, but they don't really do anything. I'm not even 100% sure why. Like most of the time it'll sort of burn for a second and then it goes away. For some people they're in agony, they get a really big red rash. Doesn't do anything. So yeah, here's the story about how I can play around with stinging nettles and shit. But yeah, I accidentally, the whole area, uh, what happened, <laughs> call this a stinging nettle challenge. Uh, what happened is I had old stinging nettle seeds and I'd always, back when I was like into psychedelics and stuff, I thought, wow, I should have a garden of just poisonous and noxious plants. You know, henbane, datura, stinging nettles and cool shit like that. Uh, I thought the seeds were useless because, you know, I had tried to plant them and they didn't grow. So I'm like, fuck it. I threw them in what used to be the compost pile. They started growing. So I'm like, fuck. I removed them once I realized what they were. Jokes on me, they had already seeded. And then they proceeded to seed themselves freely back here and they're still spreading. They've started to spread to the other side of this little path. There's no way to stop them now. It's not that they're not native to Vermont. I mean, they're everywhere anyway. But they're slowly spreading all the way up through here. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. And I think there's still a few henbane plants back here probably in the lawn that I've got to eradicate. I managed to more or less get rid of those, thankfully. That's way worse. This stinging nettle's trying to come up in the path. i got to get rid of them. At the very least, I do not want stinging nettles in the garden. But yeah, I can... Uh, play around in them. I can whack off with stinging nettles. If any of you want, you can come and I'll push you into the patch of them with the berry bushes and, you know, if you're into masochism, maybe that's your thing. That's about all. Peace out.